Callie. Callie. I'm not talking to you until you stop jumping on the couch. Fine. Thank you. Why were you jumping on the couch in the first place? Because we don't have a trampoline? You're in luck, because I know the perfect place. Wait, what are you doing? How did we get here? And how did we change clothes? You're welcome. Where exactly are we? We're at the Two Infinity Trampoline Park. How could you take me here? Wait, did you say trampoline park? I sure did. Just look around. Is that a foam pit? And a rock wall? And a floor full of trampolines? It is. And the best part of it all is it's right in our backyard, only a few miles away from LG. Then let's head straight over to Kayla to learn more about this awesome place full of activities. This amazing recreation park has been over the year in the making. After our sweet base supermarket closed down, this building sat empty until it was transformed into Two Infinity. This park opened in August and has something for everyone in the family. It's not just any park though. Two Infinity has to offer trapeze, foam pit, aerial silk, a ninja obstacle course, and much more. I helped build the park and I think it's probably the best thing that's ever came to Lincoln. Um, you get a good workout and um, you just, there's so much stuff to do and it's just like the greatest thing ever. <laughs> you know, helping put, in, put this park together uh, for Lakeland was amazing. Uh, I work here. I like I like seeing people come here and have fun. Everyone tells me it's better than Sky Zone, and I think that's true. Every day almost, I can just come out here and jump and just have fun and just do all this fun stuff. And it's a really good workout too. It's just really fun. I like having Two Infinity here in Lakeland because it's closer than all the other trampoline places. There's a lot of fun things that we can do, so we can just have fun. You know, I work here. And I see a lot of kids come here, be happy with their, with their parents. It's just a good thing to do around Lakeland. Two Infinity is a great place. This is my first time being here. I've had a lot of fun so far. It's been rocking. I mean, we cannot keep up with the amount of people that come in here. So we could not be more happy about it. And we're doing our best to keep this an awesome thing for Lakeland. It's right here, the largest extreme sports facility in the entire world. Now that you've seen all Two Infinity has to offer, you should come and check it out. Kayla Camp, TSC News. Thank you, Kayla, for all that information on 2 Infinity. Even though this place is super fun, it can also be dangerous. That's right. You see that ledge over there? Some kick and fall off. Callie, you're taking this a little too far. It's better to be safe than sorry. I guess you're right. But let's find out some real safety tips with Calissa in today's Healthy Helping. Everyone loves trampoline parks, but they can be very dangerous. Because of the unsteady floors and lots of kids running around, many injuries occur. However, Trampoline parks can be fun and safe if you follow these simple tips. Remove all jewelry, loose objects, and sharp items before jumping. Do not try flips unless you are trained or you have a spot. Injuries are prone to occur when flipping. Do not bounce too close to someone else. You could jump onto them or hurt them. Do not sit on the actual trampolines because someone may run into you and injure you. No fighting on the trampoline. No food and drink on the trampoline. It may spill, causing people to slip. By following these simple tips, it'll make your trip to your local trampoline park fun and safe. Calissa Sutterberg, TSC News. Thanks to Calissa, we can be safe and have fun all at the same time. Exactly. I wonder why our school doesn't have a room full of trampolines. That would be so cool, but there's no way that that's happening. Then I guess we should find out what's actually happening around school in today's Shark Scoop. Happy Friday, Sharks. I'm Wandy, and here's the important news you need to know. Our wrestling team has their next matches tomorrow at Lake Wales High School. All the action starts at 9.30 a.m. and it only costs $1 per student, so come out and cheer on our wrestlers tomorrow morning. Attention all LG cheerleaders. You have practice on Monday from 4.15 until 5.15. A-team members will also meet Monday from 4.15 until 5 in Ms. Goods room. FCCLA members will be at the car rider line from 8.15 until 8.45 in the morning, selling the world's finest chocolate bars for $1. They are raising money for their upcoming state and national competition. So buy some delicious chocolate and help our FCCLA this year. The school store is now open every Tuesday and Thursday morning at 8.15. Stop by to purchase all of your needed school supplies and support our store. Our girls basketball team will be playing at Rochelle School of the Arts Tuesday night at 6.30. We know they would love to see all of you there cheering them on. This week's word of the week has been skew. It's an adjective that means to turn or place at an angle, crooked. Watch our show next week for a new vocabulary word. Today's classroom spotlight is shining on our FFA team. The officers won first place Tuesday night in the county opening and closing ceremonies contest. Congratulations to Mrs. Kennedy and the team. FFA members also recently welcomed some special guests to our campus. They're pigs that we'll be raising to show and sell at the youth fire in January. The hog's name is their pigs a lot. It's hard taking care of hogs because you have to clean them, wash their pens, and take care of them. My hog's name is Miss Piggy and I take care of it by um, cleaning its pen and washing it. My pig's name is Piglicious. 
and whenever I take care of her, I have to bathe her, wash out her pen, put sunscreen and bug spray on her, and work with her. I hope everyone has a chance to check out 2 Infinity this weekend. You'll have a blast. Wandy Rodriguez, TSE News. What do you want to do? I want to do that. Are you kidding me? I'm not doing that. Why not? It looks like so much fun. Fun? Don't you remember? I'm afraid of heights. Oh yeah, then what do you want to do? We can go over there and jump on the trampolines that are on the ground. Fine. But after that, you have to promise to go on this with me. We'll see about that. But first, let's head over to Jaden with today's hot topic to find out what the shark's favorite thing about you infinity is. I'm Jaden here at two infinity. <sighs> oh my gosh. <sighs> Hold on, I need to catch more breath. <sighs> okay. <sighs> There are so many cool things to do here, from swinging on trapeze to jumping on walls. Today's top topic question is, what do you like doing here at 2 Infinity? My favorite thing to do at 2 Infinity is the swing. My favorite thing to do at 2 Infinity is jump into foam pits. My favorite thing to do at 2 Infinity is to be able to jump around and play with my family and friends. My favorite thing to do at 2 Infinity is play dodgeball. My favorite thing is to do is jump into the foam pit off the trampoline. My favorite thing to do at 2 Infinity is to try to flip off the walls. My favorite thing to do at Infinity is jump on the trampoline and then walk up the wall. My favorite thing to do at 2 Infinity is to do flips off the walls. I like to do the swings and front flip off. It seems like all the sharks like the activities here at 2 Infinity, and I know you will too. So why don't you make plans and come on and bounce? Jaden Smith, TSE News. We have had a blast here at 2 Infinity. I want to come tomorrow and the next day. Can I come? You sure can, and the sharks should come too. Don't forget to watch next week's shows on Red Ribbon Week, Halloween DIYs, and Lakeland's Best Pizza. I'm Callie. And I'm Lisa. Have, have a wonderful, wonderful weekend, Sharks. TSC News.